All right, guys, uh, welcome to the shirtless vlog. This is Sebastian Allen Sprague, the artist. Um, how's it going today? As you can tell, I got my shirt off again. Yeah, flexing on you guys. No, just kidding. Um, it's going really well with me. Thank you for asking. Uh, I had a beautiful day today. I had a beautiful night last night, actually, too. I uh, went down to Long Beach, uh, dressed as in my nicest clothes. Um, and that was really fun. I hopped on the train. It was like an hour ride long, long ride. And I met a couple of people on the way to Long Beach. Um, and then I was having such a good conversation with somebody on the train that we decided to go grab some ice cream. Um, and that was the first thing I did in Long Beach. And we parted ways after that. And uh, that was like the beginning of a really nice friendship. Uh, her name eludes me, but if you showed me three people and her face was on one of those three people, I would definitely be able to point her out. Yes, you got it. Sebastian Allen Sprague is not the best with names. I'm more of like a feelsy person. So when I'm in your presence, your energy that you give me is actually going to give away your identity. Yeah. So... That was Long Beach yesterday. It was a nice and long ride back too, but thankfully I caught the train just in time before it left. So ended up getting home about like one o'clock, which was not that bad because I had work at 11 today and I live right next to my work, Starbucks. Uh, Starbucks is going good. I had work today. And uh, I'm just like kind of clocking in my hours, getting some good practice at Starbucks. You know, I've, my weakness, one of my weaknesses is not stressing enough. Um, I think that can kind of upset some people. Um, I know that if you have brothers or sisters or even parents, you know, and, you know, you're asking them for something and they just don't put enough emphasis on your request or what you've asked them for. And it ends up taking them so long to give you what you need that's kind of the person who I am. I'm the person on the other side who just doesn't put enough emphasis, doesn't put enough stress on what the situation needs. So I'm working on that. I do my best for you guys to give you guys what you need to entertain you guys, to keep you guys interested, to keep you guys engaged, focused, and listened. And honestly, I'm just I'm just getting a little bit better at, at, at applying stress or applicating stress to the situation. Um, because I'm really just not a stressful person. I just, I don't come home and, and like, oh my gosh, so much pressure, so much pressure. No, I don't really have a pressureful life. Um, I go to work and I come home and I do whatever I want and I can relax all day if I want to. Why? Because in my mind I can relax, you know. Um, and that's, that's kind of a gift. That's kind of an ability um that not everybody has and that's my gift and my ability and i have to take the weaknesses behind it and i have to take the strengths uh behind it as well too feel good so yeah i've been talking to you guys for a couple more minutes um i just recently posted something on instagram and it says 25 the year 25 years old when i hit 25 now 24 25 is going to be an unprecedented year for my music. And uh, I'm just kind of proclaiming that, you know, in Jesus name kind of type thing. Um, I really believe it. I see the vision. People are reaching out to me, telling me I need to get my, uh, my artistic ability to the surface, you know, put it out there. People want to market. People want to market me. People want to sell my music. Uh, people want to produce my music. And... I'm very artistic and I'm very confident in my artistic abilities. Um, and that hasn't always been the case. So that's why I put the stress and the emphasis on that. Yeah, I haven't always been confident. I've always been a turtle with who I am artistically, but uh, no longer. Yeah, it's my duty, my moral duty, uh, my responsibilities, uh, my greatest passion um, to share, share that with you. Yeah. Um, people say that I have a good energy about me and it's true. I've always kind of questioned why people don't like me or why people have a problem with me. 
it's definitely not my energy. It's definitely not my my gifts that I have to share with the world. But it is definitely the weaknesses that are a part of being an artist. Yeah, haters. We're always going to have haters. We're always going to have haters. And one of my greatest teachers told me that our haters are really the best teachers. Okay, guys, this has been a shirtless vlog 24. Add me on Instagram if you guys don't have me on Instagram. Thank you again for watching my uh, my vlogs. Appreciate you guys. And i got a habit of checking myself out uh, in the video camera. I gotta stop doing that. It's the beard. It's the beard. The beard looks okay. It looks all right. All right, you guys. Uh, I'll catch you on the next video. Thank you so much again for watching. Subscribe, like.